what is up my ASMR fragrance and evidently NFL fans family. It is your boy Christopher Cologne and I'm back with another NFL picks video. So what I have today is my week six picks. My week six picks. Week six picks. And I think what I'm going to do, well, what I am going to do is I'm going to actually write them down because I know some of y'all like the writing sounds and everything. So instead of just circling them, I'm going to go ahead and write them down. So I got the schedule pulled up right here. And, um, yeah. So, oh, and last week, so week five, I was 12 and 4 over the, on that, uh, I didn't even get to watch any football last week, actually, because I'm working on a car all weekend, but, uh, yeah, the Colts won, they beat the Broncos, the Giants lost, to, or won, they beat the Packers, uh, the Lions lost to the Patriots, I think that was like 29 to nothing, something like that, um, the Chargers beat the Browns. The Jaguars beat the Texans, which, I mean, the Jaguars lost to the Texans, my bad, which I picked that wrong. The Bucks beat the Falcons, and I seen on the highlights where the Falcons were probably getting ready to beat the Bucks, so, which, that's a bad call. It was a bad call, and, I mean, that's one reason why I've kind of one reason why I started pulling away from the NFL because the NFL is full of shitty officiating. I mean, people try to say Brady gets the most of it, but that ain't true, man. If you watch football, especially the NFL, you know that the officiating through the NFL has been shit for years. I mean, it's, it's awful, really. So, um... Yeah, so and then we got the Bills beat the Steelers, the uh, the Jets lost to the Dolphins. Hold on, no. Yeah, the Jets lost to the Dolphins. Hold on, is that right? Let me let me make sure, cause I got the schedules pulled up right here. Uh, do, 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 do. So. Oh no, the Jets beat the Dolphins. Okay. Yeah, the Jets beat the Dolphins, so. Um. So, actually, I don't know. Maybe I went 13 and 3. Maybe I looked at some stuff wrong. But. Yeah, I guess I went 13 and 3. But okay. So, we're getting ready to get into this, week six. Oh, yeah. But, okay, so the Jets beat the Dolphins. The Commanders, where's that? The Commanders lost to the Titans. Um, no, that's the one. Yeah, the Commanders lost to the Titans. The Saints beat the Seahawks. The 49ers beat the Panthers. The Eagles beat the Cardinals, which the Eagles are 5-0 and now. And the Cowboys beat the Rams. I got that wrong. And the Bengals lost to the Ravens. I got that one right. And the Chiefs barely beat the Raiders. And I got that one right. So, yeah, 13-3 and for the week. So, that's, yeah, hell yeah, that's a significant improvement from the week before because I was only 6 of 10. So, okay. So, now Thursday night game. The game is going to come on here in a little while because I'm recording this Thursday during the afternoon. Um, so, we got week 6 NFL picks. I'm hoping this mic's picking that up. I did a little test run and it was, but so I'm hoping it still is. But okay, so we got 
的。
six NFL picks. I got the Bears over the Commanders, the Ravens over the Giants, the Colts over the Jaguars, the Patriots over the Browns, the Bengals over the Saints, the Bucks over the Steelers, the 49ers over the Falcons, the Packers over the Jets, uh, Hold on, did I say Bengals over the Saints? If I did, I meant Saints over the Bengals. But, uh, yeah. So the Bucks over the Steelers, the 49ers over the Falcons, the Packers over the Jets, the Vikings over the Dolphins, the Rams over the Panthers, the Seahawks over the Cardinals, the Bills over the Chiefs. I'm surprised that ain't the Sunday night game. Uh, then we got... The Cowboys, and then I got the Cowboys beating the Eagles and the Chargers beating the Broncos. So, yeah, those are my week six NFL picks. Hopefully, I could do another 13 and 3 run like I did last week. So, but yeah, y'all, hey, y'all tell me what I could do to make, to make these videos better. So, because I'm looking for a way to get my subscribers up and to get my audience retention up I mean I don't really know what the average audience uh, retention is for an ASMR video but I think it could be a lot better than what mine are so I just want to know what I'm doing wrong because I see I've seen a lot of um other ASMR artists and they don't really do anything but sit there and whisper and maybe do a little bit of tapping and they just ramble on about stuff and uh, they have so many subscribers so many um, so many views and everything and I've even seen a lot of them like newer artists don't even have as many videos as I have or anything like that so yeah I'm looking to see I'm trying to figure out what I could do better so yeah if y'all if y'all could comment down below and let me know what I could do better let me know if there's any new things I know some of y'all have mentioned role plays and I'm actually going to probably do a couple because but I've just I ain't felt like I'd be any good at them, you know? So I figured that I'd suck at them, but I got ideas for them. And then, um, one video I'm gonna do, because, uh, I have the letters my grandpa wrote to my grandma when he was deployed during, during World War II. I'm gonna do a video reading, uh, reading those I think that would be cool to do like a little piece of history so cause that is a piece of history but yeah I'm gonna read over them first just to make sure or read over some of them again just to make sure they're not too personal but yeah I think that would be cool put a little piece of history out there um cause I got a whole box of them and I had his jacket that he wore in World War II that I'd show y'all too, but I can't remember where it's at. I don't remember if my mom, if my uncle wanted it and I gave it back to him and I gave it to him or what, but it sucks. I can't think of where it's at. So, um, yeah. So y'all let me know what y'all think of what I could do better or whatever, you know, so, and, um, well, I was going to grab the bottle that, of the stuff I wore last night, but yeah, what I wore last night to work was Jimmy Choo Urban Hero Gold Edition. It's a sweet fragrance. It's pretty good, so, I don't think the performance on it is all that great as far as it, um, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, not siage, but where it pushes away from you, just creating a scent bubble. There's a word I'm looking for and I can't think of it. But, yeah, I don't think it's
types of performance as far as pushing out away from you and creating a sand bubble is all that great because it doesn't seem like it lasted all that long but then again I could be going nose blind to it but anyway so I'm gonna get off here and I'm gonna go to bed because I gotta I gotta go to bed get a few hours of sleep before I go to work tonight and I gotta turn my air conditioners back on because it's done got hot in here Carolina's around this time of year is crazy at night it's cold part of the day it's it's cooler and comfortable and then afternoon for three four hours it gets hot so the carolinas are crazy <laughs> but yeah y'all but i guess i'm gonna hop off here and hopefully i'll be getting y'all another video pretty soon and as always y'all have a good one and peace